What's up guys and welcome to Ark Pirate World and this is a mod that I found for Ark that actually puts you into an entirely different map. It's made up of very many small islands and it's pirate themed so it still has the usual like survival elements. There's still dinosaurs I still need to eat and defend myself and stuff like that but apparently I've seen screenshots of ships and cutlasses and blunder busts and cannons and all of this really cool stuff so I haven't played any of it. I have no idea what we're in store for. I figured I would explore that with you guys, but it looks hilarious. And right off the bat, I just spawned on this island. I think I see a treasure chest down there. So I kind of want to find my way through all of these dinosaurs. Once again, we are playing as Arya, so Arya has returned. She left um, our dinosaurs behind from last episode, but they're still there. This doesn't actually delete your single player campaign. It just switches it over to a new map. So if we want to go back, we always can, but... Right now, we are on our own, and that means we are once again at the bottom of the food chain. So everything wants to eat Arya, because she's just so delicious. I really want to know what's in these chests. I don't know if these were placed, um, like the drops. Maybe that's what these are. Can I... Oh, oh, crap. Oh, come on. I just want to see what's inside. Goddamn bugs. Okay, if that's the case, we may need to be quick, because these bugs are not happy campers. So do we, what do we get? What do we get? Uh, copper, silver, gold, and a gold bag. All right, we'll take all of that and get running. I uh, don't want to die. Okay, so yeah, that's one thing that I think I read, is that there's now an economy. You can actually find, like, civilizations in this. Shops. I don't think there's NPC people, but there's places like bulletin boards where you can buy a ship or you can buy a weapon or whatnot. So you don't have to build it. So maybe we'll uh, we'll try to survive for a little bit and see if we can find one of these ports. Hello, dodos. I thought you guys were going to be different, but you're just pooping here in the rocks. Yeah, maybe we can find something. You never know. And uh, if not, we can always cheat. <laughs> oh, what do you want? Oh, go away. Copies, chompies, whatever the hell your names were. I don't have time for this. I'm going to turn you into meat if you don't leave me the hell alone. Why are you so strong? Why are you so strong? Okay, okay, no, nope, nope, nope. Once again, back to the bottom of the food chain. <laughs> We're starving to death. We're getting eaten by compies. I'm pretty sure they're called compies, not chompies. This is some bullshit. This is some bullshit. This is total bullshit. Oh, come on. I don't know why we have like this Kool-Aid lake here, but we're going for a swim. Okay. Did he, I think he, oh my God. This is just as bad as the rest of the arcs. There is no food here anywhere. I can't eat any of these. <laughs> as you can see, this is just like any other arc. We are still gonna be eaten by stuff. Uh, we're still gonna be surrounded by funny looking rocks. This is new. All these kind of, look at all the piranhas. Not going in Kool-Aid Lake anymore. And raptors, and okay, that's just great. <laughs> like I was trying to say, we still need to eat, we're starving to death, we can still get eaten. All the survival elements are still there, there's just pirate things elsewhere, which I'm hoping that we can find soon, because I, I may just die. Not really looking forward to dying. Oh, berries, berries, thank you. Thank you, berries. Um, num num. Give me, give me berries. Mijo berries. Yum. Found some berries, but there's a cat eating a bird up there, and I don't want to get any closer to that. <laughs> really making my life difficult already, man. I wasn't planning on this episode being much survival. I wanted to just do a bunch of pirate stuff, but uh, apparently pirate stuff is for the strong, and we are still weak. Do we have enough berries to not tobacco seed? Is that new? I feel like that's new. So apparently you can grow, and I would assume if you're growing it, you can't eat it. So it must be to like roll and sell. Maybe you can make that another kind of currency if you work on it, or smoke. That would be really cool. I need to look into this whole tobacco thing, but I think we now have berries to not die. I don't know what we're gonna do, man. Like we're just, we're trapped on this island. Like I said, there's islands all over the place. And I've been walking around this one for a little while now. I have not seen much of anything. Maybe I can get a, a higher standpoint and take a look around. Oh, no. No. You don't want any of me. No, no. Oh, you're stuck. Hmm. Stuck, you say. I'll remember that. He might be free food. But for now, I think we just need to take a look around. Yeah, you see, there's another island. And I assume another one over there. But I'm not seeing any civilization. Crap. We managed to build a spear. I'd say I'd be able to defend myself now, but let's be honest, I cannot defend myself against anything around here. If anything picks a fight with me, 
I am running. This is strictly for morale purposes. Makes me feel a little bit better. I'm probably going to have to put it away to gather more berries because we are quickly starving to death. Is that a giant hunk of free food I see? No way. Is does the do the, do the sea god smile upon us today? Oh wait, I need to be using this because I want meat. Give me meat. Give me meat. One meat. Two meat. Four meat. Okay, four meat. That's not nothing. We can make a fire. We might not die now. <laughs> I don't know what we're gonna do because I don't think every island has like civilization or a port on it. And the one that I've started on seems to just be full of resources. And we can't really get to another one swimming because, well. The, the ocean's not a very nice place to be swimming in. And I don't really want to die because we have so much cool stuff. Like, we've got copper, we have silver, we have... We have a pirate ship? What? Arya, where are you keeping this pirate ship? I don't understand. We're gonna make a run for the water. We're, we're just gonna make a, a sprint for the water through all of the dinosaurs. I don't know if you start with a pirate ship, and I just didn't notice or if we found it in that chest. I'm pretty sure we only found money in that chest, but I was kind of rushed because of bugs. So I don't, I, I can't wait to see if this is gonna work. Maybe this is just the blueprint or something like that. Either way, we're just gonna get in the water and give it a try. I also don't know how much space this thing might need. How big do you think a pirate ship is? I don't wanna go too far out because sharks. Okay, this this might be good. So can we, uh, pirate Carrick, uh, care equip with pirate flag. Okay, use. Whoa! Whoa! Are you kidding me? No way! We have a pirate ship! Oh, this is so cool! What? <laughs> I can't believe it! And we can get out and we can just. Oh my god, this thing is huge! We can actually, like, walk around on it. I bet you we could have dinosaurs on this and stuff, too. So that's where we drive it. Is there like a below deck? I think this was technically the below deck. And like go down here? Can we get in here? No, that is to drive it as well. Okay. This is awesome. That that just single-handedly made this mod for me. The fact that we have a full-blown pirate ship that we can go around on. I'm kind of afraid to go all the way out here. That is so badass. Yeah, all right, so let's um, let's go sail around, see if we can find ourselves some civilization. I love that it has like the creaking boat noises as well. It's just silence up on the water and then your creaking boat. Still have not found any ports or civilization. I'm pretty sure they exist. Maybe I'm mistaken because I, I, I didn't do a whole lot of research into the mod. I wanted to discover a lot of this stuff with you because I feel like that's a lot more entertaining. It's a lot more fun for me as well. But, like, I'm 99% I'm sure that there's supposed to be, like, ports around here or something. If we don't find one, actually, you know what? Screw it. I don't think we're going to find one anytime soon. I'm just going to cheat. So let's see here. I'm pretty sure that there are new engrams. Hmm. Yeah, see? Tobacco dryer. Put tobacco leaves on it to dry them. That's cool. So we can... Um, uh, and we can smoke it in a pipe. And we can get harsh tobacco. Okay, so we actually can smoke our tobacco seeds. You can have an entire tobacco plantation. That is really neat. Uh, spyglass, that's useful for a pirate. What else do we got here? There's definitely more new things. I've seen a bunch. Raft. Gold bag. Okay, so we can make our own gold by collecting things. And we have a Jack Sparrow hat. I would like one of those, please. That sounds super epic. I like that. Uh, and a cutlass or a pirate sword. Sorry, not technically a cutlass. Ooh, another pirate hat. I want all the pirate hats. If I can get any pirate hats, that'll be good. Bottling machine. Bottling machine can be used to fill a bottle. Used to fill a bottle with what? And you need... Requires a smithy. Okay. So we can fill bottles with stuff. Maybe with rum. Can we have... Can we make alcohol? Alcohol machine used for fermenting and distilling different alcohols. This mod is crazy. So we can not only have booze, we can also make smokes for our pirate life. That is so epic. And I'm not a very high level yet, so it looks like there's more things to potentially unlock. Oh, I need to be level 35 to get cannons on my ship. Okay, maybe we'll save that for another episode. But right now, we can make... Pirate hat, we need hide and copper ingots. Where do we get copper ingots? 
Um, hide and fiber, hide and fiber. Okay. So, and then I guess we need a smithy to make the sword. I'm going to cheat to get these resources because obviously we're not going to be able to make ingots. I don't have, like, the stuff that's required. I don't have a base. We're only just starting off. I'll be right back. And through the magic of console commands, I have managed to give us a smithy, and I found out that you can actually build them on your ship. This entire ship acts like one giant floating base, which is crazy. I cannot imagine what some people have built on this, and I can't wait to see what I can manage to put on it. But right now we have a smithy in the back. I've given us all of the resources that we need, so I'm going to build a cutlass. i build us one of those. I also want to build... Do I want to build a jet? So the Jack Sparrow hat is like... Um, it's more of a bandana. I think it would be more... Can I build both? Yeah, let's just build both. Screw it. I want to see what they both look like. Gross. I don't like that one at all. What is... I figured that it wouldn't be very good. The pirate hat... Oh, yeah. There we go. <laughs> it's, uh... It's got some issues to it. It's got some minor, pro minor problems, but I mean... I look a little bit more piratey. How about I take my sword out? Because that is going to be way better than that spear. That is cool. Okay. Oh, that is really, that's really well done. Holy crap. I'm, I'm, I'm pleased. No, no, no. Stop, 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 stop. Ah. Oh. Okay. That was a little anticlimactic. There is no reverse, however. These ships are lacking in reverse. So, are we just marooned? Don't tell me I just marooned my first ship. Oh, no. Okay. We're good. Yeah, we're good. Screw you, shark. Okay, we're out. So, where are we gonna go? I wanna try dicing up some dinosaurs. That's that's my main goal right now, is to go see how the cutlass fares. I would imagine it's probably similar to the regular sword. Shit, shit, shit. Shitty balls. What the hell? Oh, it's the edge of the world. Oh. Okay. That's good to know. So I guess we know where we are now. We are near an island that is right up against the edge of the map. Am I even gonna be able to squeeze through here? It is freaking out. Okay, we're good. We're good. Actually, that's that's a good thing, because now we can probably see where the hell we are. We are west. 99% sure that we're west, maybe? I don't know. I don't know where we started. I just, I, I spawned randomly, because it didn't matter. I guess it still, still doesn't really matter. I don't know what any of the islands hold, so in reality, this is this is reminding me a lot of Stranded Deep. We're just going to go island to island. We're going to see what's up, what each island has to hold for us on the open seas. Let's see how this sword fares. Oh, it's doing pretty good. It's doing a lot of work. Yeah. All right. So it, it is actually quite effective. It, it does its job. I haven't forgotten you compies, you little bastards. Where are you running to? I just killed your brother. Yeah, that's right. You turn into hide, you son of a bitch. <laughs> oh, that is awesome. I'm still really... De Man, that looks cool. That is so cool. Okay, I'm really determined to find one of the uh, one of the areas. Okay, that's a T-Rex. We're going to go back to the ship. Um, maybe I'll jump cut again, and I'll, I'll look around a little bit more. Maybe we'll get a little bit more lucky. I, I, it's got to be here somewhere, right? This place is starting to feel more and more like home. But we are not going to be striking that and going down Titanic style. <laughs> I've already marooned my ship. Last thing I need to do is sink it. I don't know if they take damage. They probably do. I can't imagine they're invincible. Uh, but I really want to check out this island. Because it's very weird. It looks like it's frozen on top, but desert on bottom. Not making a whole lot of sense. So I think we are gonna, we're going to stop right around here. Ooh, a chest. Okay. We'll get out. And we're going to take a dive off of the nose again. That's, that's probably going to be safe, right? That water's got to be deep enough. I have yet to jump into shallow water in the ocean. Yeah, there we go. Okay, I want to see what's in this chest. If it's more money... Like I said, I think the, the reason that there's money is you can find it, and in multiplayer you would fight people for the money, and then you can use that to buy things. So, like, you would actually buy that ship from a shipyard using your doubloons or your copper or your gold or whatever you find. And, uh... And we've been pretty lucky. We already found one, and now we're going to find another one. If I can manage to get by without getting seen by all the sharp-toothed dinosaurs. What do you got for me? What do you got? Gimme, gimme, gimme. Gold bag, gold, silver. Cool. Okay. I like it. Neat. So let's see what this island has to offer. There's got to be something here. 
Very important for me not to forget where the ship is. The ship is in that direction. It is downhill. I am going to keep moving inland, but if we... I don't think I can get another ship. We can't lose it. Hello, Mr. Castle on top of the mountain. And holy shit, there's a ton of penguins here. You guys are going to hate me for this, but I'm kind of freezing to death and starving to death, and I need food, so we are going to set up shop in this castle and eat... Oh, God, did I just orphan another pe... Why do I always do that? So we're going to set that down, and we're going to put our meat in so that we don't die. All right. So, yeah, we found a castle. That's cool. There's nothing here, which is kind of disappointing. It's empty. I guess that this is like a, a point of contention for multiplayer or something like that, and it's just kind of something cool for us right now. I need food. Put food in my mouth. I was gonna say put meat in my mouth, but that's probably not appropriate. Okay, we're, we're good. We're not gonna die. There we go. What are you looking at, you stupid turtle? Okay, so there's stuff over here. There's a cannon. I'm kind of hoping that we can use this cannon. Maybe we can... A treasure map? No way. What did we just... How did we just... This just popped up. Okay, so there's treasure below the tree next to the other trees beside the, the rock. Whose pirate child drew this? This isn't useful at all. Oh, I see. Okay, and then, yeah, can't, I know I saw it. That's a very nice drawing. Okay, can we can we take the cannon? No. We cannot pack up the cannon and take it with us. I have no idea. I have no idea where this could be. I'm sure if you play this mod for long enough, you'd be like, oh, yeah, it's right below that big tree above that squiggly rock. But, like, I'm new here. I don't even know where I am, nonetheless, where this is. So maybe I'll save that for another episode. But that's gonna be it for this episode of Ark, guys, and I would love to do another pirate mod episode, you know, there's still a couple of things left to do. I could put cannons on my ship, and I could go exploring and finding more things like this, and maybe finding hidden treasure. I think that would be a lot of fun, but the Ark series as a whole is not gonna go back to the way that it once was. It's not gonna be every Saturday, it's not gonna be me doing the normal surviving dinosaurs and taming things, because the thing about a survival game like this is, is once you've overcome the elements, and you've overcome the dinosaurs, and you've survived, kind of like I did with Stranded Deep, then everything moving forward is just repetition. And I'm not really proud of repeating myself. I don't have fun doing the same thing every week and feeling like I'm obligated to do it. And then that doesn't make for entertaining videos. So I know a lot of people had questions as to what was going on with Ark because a lot of people don't follow me on Facebook or don't follow me on Twitter or don't read the comments or don't watch the vlogs. I make specific videos telling people what is happening to Ark and people don't watch it and then don't know what's happening. So that's kind of how I set out my net of information. And if you guys want to find out what's going on, then that's where you're going to find it. You know, I can't force you to find the information, but there's no point in demanding that I do Ark on a bunch of other videos videos because I don't follow demands and I've done my best to get that information to you guys. So I thought I would mention that because it is frustrating when you go through a lot of effort to get that information to people and they don't bother to find it. But moving forward, I don't know what's going to happen to Ark. It might show up every now and then. You know, if I find something new, then I'm going to do it. And if I don't find anything new, then I'm not going to feel obligated to make an Ark video every Saturday and just kind of slog through it. I want to do no new things. It's going to leave room for new series and new games and, and a lot of new great things to the channel. So look forward to all of that and maybe look forward to more Ark. You know what? You never know. But thank you guys for much watching this video. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time. Because I have had enough of this. Can Timmy, I swear to God, if you interrupt me one more time, I will kill everybody in this vault with my bare hands. Just your bare hands? Really? What? Wh why? Why do you sound excited for that? Almost happy. <laughs>